Hey guys, this is Will of TyBL and welcome back to my channel. Last May and June, I did two videos about the upcoming BL series in late 2020 to 2021. In this video, I'm going to share with you my insights on what's my ranking of my anticipated TyBL series for the half of 2020. I'm just going to include only those BL series that will be released this 2020 and not in 2021. This ranking is not final and will surely change once all of those BL series are released. Also, the ranking is based on the trailer and its synopsis. You can also share your own ranking on the comment section below. Anyway, if you live in a different country and some BL series are not available to yours, you can use ExpressVPN to watch those restricted series. You can download ExpressVPN on the description below. Without further ado, let's get right into the video. On the number 8 spot, I put Motorcycle the series. The reason I put this series on the number 8 spot is because of its theme. This is just my personal preference but I'm not into this kind of genre. Although it's not like any other BL series that I have watched before, I felt that the trailer was a bit of messy and confusing. It has a lot of characters which I think it might be confusing for the viewers. Based on the trailer, it will have too much third party for the main characters. The acting was not that good for me to appreciate the series but I hope that it will get better on the actual release of the series. This series was an unexpected one. I did not anticipate that this series is coming anytime soon. Although it's not clear whether this series will be released internationally, the series really looks promising. Pod and Kowtoon, as the main couple of this series is a fresh one in the BL world. This is another one-sided love like what I have said on my previous video but it would have a happy ending. I am excited how they would pull off this series because based on the trailer, it has a kind of light story. We also get Mike and Top Tap as the side couple here and that really makes me excited. I was not that satisfied in their screen time on together so seeing them here completed my day. It's undeniable that they are great chemistry. Oxygen is one of my most anticipated BL series for this year. Everything in the trailer looks fantastic and the novel looks good also although I haven't read it all yet. The OST of the series is also good and setting a good ambience of the series. The cast also looks promising and I am hoping that the acting will be good too. The series already encountered how many delays of airing because of the post-production issues but hopefully, it would air soon. There are not much BL that currently airs right now so they better air it now and become a popular BL series. Although it's only composed of 5 special episodes, I'm highly anticipating this series because of its not so good ending. I must say that GMM did not expect that the series would get so popular that is why they did a follow up quickly after the series ended. Although Together received a lot of criticisms because of its ending, it is undeniably one of the most popular and most watched BL series in Lime TV. Still Together will tell us the continuation of the story of Solo Watt and Time after one year of their relationship. I'm also looking forward for the development of the side couples here most especially Mill and Fukong since they did not have any label yet in the original series. I'm betting that the series would also improve because of the new director and hopefully the script writers. I already did two videos based on the special book of this series and you can check it out above. Still Together remains one of the anticipated special season of the series and I hope we could have the ending that we deserve.
I placed this series on number 4 because it is one of my favorite series of all time. The love story of Tin and Ken in the previous season did not have a good ending and I'm happy that this series gives them the story they deserved. I'm just a bit sad that Pete would not be included in this season because of the plot. Anyway, I hope that this series is as interesting as its first season. The season 1 was a huge success for the series and I hope that the season 2 would live up to its success also. Although I'm a huge fan of this series, I did not find one character amusing for me. The character of Clark is the only thing that I don't anticipate in this series because of what happened in the season 1. I hope that they drastically change that part because it was really disturbing and not healthy in any way. That's the only thing that I do not like in this series. Overall, the return of the casts is a blessing for the fans of LBC. Although they haven't released an official trailer yet for this series, I'm really anticipating that this series would be huge. The genre of this BL series is vastly different from every BL series that we have watched. Also, it is also anticipated by many because of the return of the legends, Max and Tool, in the BL world. We were so accustomed to their steamy scenes before but Manner of Death is a different one so we will see the different side of both actors. The only challenge for this type of the series is how they would balance the genre of crime and the BL. That's basically two opposite genres and I can't wait how they would put that twist. Manner of Death is a first of a kind BL series and I'm hoping that the series would be supported by the BL fans. I put this on my number 2 because this series is one of the best BL series and one of my favorite BL series from 2019. The return of Than and Type in the screens is one of the most anticipated to happen since the season 2 was announced. The huge success of the season 1 made this series to happen in 2020. The development of the main characters for this season will surely be a lot mature since it will happen after 7 years of their relationship. The author of the novel said that the series will be a bit different on the early episodes so that's more interesting even for the novel readers. I'm hoping that this season 2 will be as big or even greater than the season 1. The reason I put this on my number 1 is because of its theme and storyline. The actors are also quite interesting to be honest. Even though GMM only released one trailer for this series, I can see that the chemistry of the main characters are there to make our fantasies alive. I hope that this series would be able to tell a different kind of love story that we haven't seen yet in a BL series. The OST of the series is also a good one and I see myself listening to it repeatedly once the series has aired. I just hope that GMM does not forget this BL because I haven't seen any update for this series yet. There were a lot of unexpected BL series that are just announced but already has an airing date. I hope we could see this beautiful BL in 2020. This ranking is a bit late for 2020 but it's not official so don't take it seriously. It was only my way to tell you my anticipation for the upcoming BL series. I just want to share with you my thoughts of them. If you have different opinions, you can share with us on the comments. As you can see, there were some BL series that are not included here because I don't know their storylines yet. Also, there are some novels that will be released as a series soon and those novels have pretty good plot. Thank you for watching. That's it and see you on the next one.